Hi folks, Max from Galaxy S2 Root.com for this week's T-Mobile Galaxy S2 Brahma of the Week. Check out the latest AOKP. Uh, this is actually an unofficial AOKP, uh, but it is based on the latest Android 4.4.4. A pretty solid ROM along with uh, I put Uber Kernel, uh, which allows you to overclock up to 2 GHz if you want to. Um, to get overclocking, I do recommend getting Trickster Mod app from the Play Store, uh, and then go ahead and go to General. And you'll be able to overclock up to uh, 2 gigahertz, which is 1.998 gigahertz. But I do recommend about 1.89, um, no more than that. Make sure you check that off. And also make sure you uh, set kernel settings on so next time it reboots, um, it will automatically overclock for you. Uh, but overall, pretty solid ROM. Everything works out of the box. Um, with the latest version, uh, obviously you'll get uh, theme packs uh, just like the latest CM11. Um, so you'll, you'll be able to get uh, additional uh, themes here, AOKP uh, White Kit Kat if you want to. This is the theme that it comes with. Um, so you'll be able to experience uh, AOKP's own theme. There we go. Uh, pretty cool stuff. And uh, you can also go back to the regular theme. Um, ROM control, of course, uh, you know, for those of you who know how to do this, you can go ahead and skip this and just go ahead and install the ROM. Pretty solid. Uh, but for those of you who don't know, let me just kind of go over some of the stuff. Uh, recent RAM bar, wake up on charger. Uh, your recent RAM bar is when you hold the uh, home button down and you see your recents. That's the RAM bar there. And let me go ahead and go back here. Uh, lock screen options, you can go ahead and use your volume as a uh, rocker wake. Uh, battery arc handle, rotate, lock screen. Lock screen notifications, um, this will show you the notifications in your lock screen which is very nice I really love it uh, one of my favorite features of AOKP uh, status bar double tap to sleep a brightness slider um, also you can go ahead and double tap to sleep pretty cool stuff there and oh you saw the battery bar there uh, that's kinda nice it makes it look nicer and also let's go look at some other uh, stuff here status bar that was the status bar. Toggles, you can go ahead and customize all of your toggles here. Add more toggles if you want to. Uh, USB tether screen recording. Um, all these new things. Immersive mode, which makes your screen bigger. Hardware keys, you can go ahead and customize all of your keys. Not there, actually. Uh, power menu, you can go ahead and uh, show option for screen recording. Navigation bar, if you want soft keys. Navigation ring, um, you have to have navigation bar enabled. Uh, more stuff you can do. I'm not going to go over all of them, uh, but uh, you know, a ton of fun with the latest Android 4.4.4. Of course, the camera working great. Uh, there is a slight lag uh, when recording, but recording actually works just fine. You just have to wait for a little bit. That's the only bad thing about it, but you can actually pause and record. Um, so, very nice stuff. Uh, the still shots work just fine and you can go ahead and also install Google Camera off the Play Store after installing this ROM if you want to. Alright, overall, overall very nice combination, you get very nice speed, of course AOKP's full ROM control on the latest Android 4.4.4, definitely check it out The check it out for this week's ROM will be uh, the combo uh, with the AOKP 4.4.4 along with the Uber a latest Uber kernel, which gives you overclocking up to two gigahertz. I uh, love it. So definitely try out this combo if you've been looking for a good combo, and do let me know what you think. Uh, also, another good combo is CM11 ROM, and uh, yeah, that's about it. And as always, if you have a Galaxy S2, don't forget to subscribe to my email list at galaxyS2root.com, and I will see you guys soon. Stay hoy on Android.